Well, OptiMan, here we are on Christmas Eve, day number 24 of Tagmas. And today's topic is uh, a couple movies I watched last night, you know, just because of everything we've been talking about. I know you said you watched Jingle All the Way. Yep. I watched Edward Scissorhands and also Night Before Christmas. Went on a little Tim Burton. Uh... Yeah, <laughs> and I was, I was gonna watch Corpse Bride, but I was just like, I, I got Tim Burton out by about uh, four hours in. <laughs> but uh, as I'm watching Edward Scissorhands, I totally forgot that was a Christmas movie. Yeah, it is kind of a weird one because, you know, like just on the intro, it might not seem like it is, but it does. It is. Yeah, it's, no. It, it's a grandma sitting there with her kid and saying, she's like, where's the snow come from? And then yeah. she tells the story. Yeah. And then it kind of ends on like a Christmas type of yeah, feeling. Yeah, for sure. I noticed that with Tim Burton's stuff, though, like uh, even with the Batmans he did, yeah, um, like you know, like Batman Returns, uh, it was very Christmas themed. Yeah, I think he loves Christmas. He just, he, you know, is <laughs> is it's kind of like dark, but he enjoys, you know, the festivities of, yeah. of the holidays. So. Um, and then on a side note, when I watched Nightmare Before Christmas, you're gonna laugh at me, but I totally forgot it was a musical. <laughs> oh yeah, it totally is, and I think that's why I don't have a lot of memories because when I was younger, I hated musicals. Yeah. No, I understand, um, but now now that I'm older and I can appreciate it a little yeah, bit. Yeah, I was like, nah, that's fine. It's great. Love but, it. Yeah, like the what's this, you know? And yeah. yeah, absolutely. So here we are on almost our last day of Tagmas. This is uh, you know Christmas Eve, mm -hmm. and we have one ginormous, awesome present from X Shot. This was sent in from X Shot, and uh, I'll let you yeah, let's, start let's to pop go. that off. Let's get this going. Look here. what's in here. We got a ton of cool stuff. We got this really sweet tactical vest. Do you mind throwing this on? I don't. Actually. Here, I'll let you throw that on. Yeah. We got this. This is the, uh, I want to say it's the Omega. It's not the Crusher. It's a little bit smaller, but it's gold. Look at that, <laughs> gold barrel. Yeah. And if that's not enough, they included gold chain in here too. Man, this thing just looks beautiful. And just a million gold darts. Like this thing is, there is just a, a ridiculous amount of gold darts. Now, if you haven't done so already, check out the, uh, what was that? Oh, you weren't in that video. Which it one? was the uh, the X Squad. Was I it? was not in the yeah, X Squad. Yeah, I really wanted you to be in that. That was that was fun. So we did a video with Brett and Luchador. And uh, yeah, it was, it was a lot of fun. And special guest appearance from Luke from Out of Darts. He was the, he was like the contraband uh, lord in which we had to fight and he had pew pews. It was really good. Mm. But yeah, we want to do more funny uh, funny videos and that kind of stuff because uh, yeah, this is really cool. X-Shot's already sending more stuff. Oh wow. We got another, uh, I don't know how to describe it, but it was it just looked really good. We'll, we'll leave it at that because I don't know how much I can say about it. Yeah. Yeah, so on today's video, we're basically going to be doing, uh, this is a review of the Omega. Uh, this is the gold version, but it's gonna be the Omega. Mm -hmm. But the first thing worth noting about the Omega versus the Crusher is it's a little smaller. Mm -hmm. No, absolutely. Other than that, I think it's a little bit more reliable because Beret was doing some filming and I ended up handing this to him and he was like able to get better shots with it because it didn't, I don't know. It's like the Crusher, well, part of it too is because like those Crushers go through those challenges where we're just feeding, you know, 10,000 darts through it. Right. They get kind of boogered up. Yeah. But this one seemed to be performing really well. <clears throat> no, I mean, it's obviously such a nice design. They even made the micro version of this. I don't know if you've seen that before. I'm sure you have. Uh, Lucha did the video where he poured water on it and it grew. Or was that the Crusher? Uh. Yeah, no, it's it looks great. Top prime. It's a it's a Springer that has a turning ro rotating turret. Oh, that's true. Like yeah. The where else? It's yeah. really unique. That is true. Generally, when you see that rotation. Yeah, go ahead and give it a rotation. That's yeah. There you go. There it is. So every time you pull it. Yeah, that's really cool. Get that chain gun action. Pretty neat. Nifty. No, I think it's really cool. Yeah. Just like to note, they did uh, decal both sides, which is always a plus. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, this is this isn't Hasbro. Yeah, this isn't Hasbro. They're and this not is... notorious for. What is this for? Uh, I want to say that's the release. Oh yeah, and the, of course this thing is slam fires. It's good enough that. Yeah. 
exposure. But yeah, enough talking about it. Let's uh, take it outside. We're gonna get some chronograph readings and then just hose down some targets and see how effective it is. Absolutely. Let's go. After taking this outside, we can see it's, uh, this thing really shines on its ability to just kind of rapidly slam fire out shots. The FPS is all right, but keep in mind these uh, these darts, the Zuru darts, are a little bit shorter than your standard darts, so that's why they usually have a little bit higher FPS. It's also worth noting that the clearance inside of this thing, you are able to fire off your standard Elite darts, so uh, there is enough clearance in here, we did check. In conclusion, I wanna thank XShot for sending these awesome Royal Edition blasters and all this cool you know, XShot merch and swag, super cool. If you haven't done so already, please subscribe to the channel. There's a lot more X Shot stuff coming, so yeah, it's gonna be exciting. Well, I'm Dr. Flux. Thank you for watching today's video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, happy foam flinging.